here's a great meatloaf recipe where beans are used to expand the meat and it's so tasty. I hope you'll enjoy this one. So in my bowl, I have two pounds of ground beef. You can use ground turkey, ground chicken, whatever you like. And then I have about a 15 ounce can of black beans that have been drained and rinsed. I'm gonna add a little bit of green pepper to that and some white onion. I don't like to use sweet onion and things like this because that sweetness can overpower if you leave it in the refrigerator overnight. And then I'm gonna add a little bit of just a, a Mexican mixed cheese. And then I wanna take about a cup of tortilla chips, which have just been crushed. Now these, if they're salty, you wanna make sure that you really monitor how much more salt you put in everything. And then I'm gonna take some cilantro and a little bit of jalapeno for me. You don't have to put this in, but I think without the jalapeno, it just doesn't quite take on that Southwest flavor. I'm gonna take an egg, and I like to just kind of break through that egg a little bit with my fingers, and you see that I'm using gloves, and that's because it gets so sticky as I'm doing this. Anytime you mix up a meatloaf, gloves are a good idea. And then we're gonna take a little bit of cumin, a little bit of chili powder and some garlic and I just want to kind of sprinkle that garlic all over so I make sure it doesn't get stuck in one clump. Then I'm going to take a little bit of salt and I want to just kind of take that, let me take that with a nice dry hand and I'll throw on another glove. So a little bit of salt and I don't want to use a whole lot. I'm going to use about a half teaspoon because my chips did have some salt in them. And then I'm going to take some pepper, some fresh ground black pepper. Oh, squeaky. Just a little bit. I don't like a lot of pepper in that. And then I'm going to throw on another glove and just mix this up. I always keep gloves in my kitchen because I use a lot of jalapenos and I'm terrible for touching my face. Everybody stop touching your face. That's what I keep hearing, but it's really a hard practice to stop. So I make sure that I have gloves because if you use jalapenos, you can really get terrible burns on your skin and in your eyes from this. Now what I'm going to do is mix this really well. I'm going to pat it into a nice loaf and then I'm going to bake it at 375 for an hour. I'm going to take it out when it's done and then add some salsa to the top just like you do ketchup or tomato sauce on a regular meatloaf and then a little bit of that Mexican cheese on top as well pop it back in and it's going to be delicious. So I hope you'll enjoy this recipe and all the recipes that I have. And until next time, stay healthy.